before I start this video, just to let you know, this here is a skit video. Nothing I mention or act in this video need to be taken serious. If I see any comment trying to take this video too seriously, like I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna remove your comment because I don't tolerate people having to take jokes seriously because unless if it's extreme, then that, um, that's different, but if it's jokes like skits, like NASCAR skits and skits with other users, it like I hate it when people have to take stuff seriously like that. But yeah, this skit is if Pre how Preston Racing would like rage if he actually watched um the 2014 Ford 400 Championship race, which if you didn't know, Kevin Harvick won that championship, and you know how much he hates Kevin Harvick. Like, he hates him with a passion. So, another thing, I am using some of my, like, my, some of my first NASCAR diecasts and some of my older diecasts, diecasts that I've had for years, and I know they all look badly beat up, if not Sharpie, so, yeah, just beware of that. But anyways, aside from that, I hope you enjoy. One more time around here at Homestead Miami Speedway. Ryan Newman trying to close the gap behind the four of Kevin Harvick. Harvick trying to catch up to some lap traffic to get away from Newman. Down the back straightaway. Kevin Harvick trying to duck down low. Kevin Harvick laps Ricky Stenhouse. Coming to turns three and four. Kevin Harvick coming down the front straightaway is about to get his very first NASCAR Sprint Cup Series championship. Kevin Harvick wins the race, and gets his very first NASCAR Sprint Cup Series championship here at Homestead Miami Speedway. Kevin Harvick, your 2014 NASCAR Sprint Cup champion. Kevin Harvick finally gets his first ever championship. Has won the 2007 Daytona 500. And is a two-time Brickyard 400 winner. Kevin Harvick just cannot believe... What he is experiencing right now. Not to mention this is our final NASCAR Spring Cup Series race on Racing Sports Network. And after this race we will no longer be hosting NASCAR races forever. Unless in the coming years things change. But for now we say goodbye to NASCAR on Racing Sports Network. As we will no longer host Truck Series races. The Nationwide Series races. Or Spring Cup Series races on Racing Sports Network. Thank you all for watching. Hope you guys have a great rest of your night. And we'll see you guys next year for, the for I guess, NASCAR Talks on Racing Sports Network. Meanwhile, at the Preston Racing Household. No! 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 Why? Why? No! No! Why? I can't believe this just happened! Kevin Harvick won the freaking NASCAR Spring Cup Series Championship! No! No! I wasted all this year for nothing! And to see Mr. Cheapskate right here win the championship! No! See this? This is what happened. Two of the championship contenders losing to this city right here, Mr. Cheapskate Harvick. Always gotta be such a cheapskate. The real champion should be Denny Hamlin right here. No, not this idiot. Mi ah! I can't. I don't even want to get into the races right now. All right, here's this race. Stop yelling over there, Preston. Ugh. Hey, my parents trying to interrupt me. You know what? I'm gonna put a I'm gonna put inside of there so that way I can lose my voice. There. That should do the job. But why? 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 You should have stayed over at RCR where you belonged. You should have never went to Stuart House Racing. You don't even belong at Stuart House Racing. Mr. Cheapskate. Denny Hamlin should have won the championship. Since Ryan Newman was out there, he could have won the championship, but nope. It had to be Mr. Cheapskate cheating Harvick. No. Two hours of raging later.
By the way, this is just a made-up NASCAR user I made called the NASCAR 24 Kid. Whoa, somebody lost his voice. That must be Preston the Denny Hamlin fanatic, Estee 2008. Yo, Preston, can you hear me or can you talk? Apparently, I can't hear him. I can't. Oh, God. I gotta see what's going on. Dang it! He put a freaking 70-pounder on his door again! Every time his least favorite driver wins, he always has to put the biggest weight on his door so that way no one can burge in. Why is... Why is he like this? Why is he like this? He needs to stop raging over Kevin Harvick winning the championship. He needs to get over it. Harvick really deserved it anyways.